Hello everyone, I'm Augusta Myers. Welcome to One Albuquerque Media and this week's City News Brief. City Parks and Rec, along with Senior Affairs and Family and Community Services, partnered last weekend on Operation Cooldown, a combination of efforts to help Albuquerque stay cool during the current heat wave. Operation Cooldown is comprised of three elements, extended splash pad hours, incentives to use city pools, and city park sprinkler play. The city also announced available resources for the at-risk populations. Mayor Keller and City Parks and Rec announced a plan to expand Albuquerque's dog park system, doubling the number of dog parks within the city. Last week, Parks and Rec discussed different dog park projects that are in different phases of development, including new mini dog parks, standard dog parks, and sites for potential future dog parks. ABQ Ride has partnered with Visit Albuquerque and leaders from the Indian Pueblo Cultural Center to honor Pueblo culture and promote tourism with three new bus wrap designs. Modeled after an ad campaign on the Denver light rail system, Visit Albuquerque worked with local artists and the city to bring the concept home. The three designs will be displayed indefinitely and represent New Mexican culture ranging from architecture to Pueblo pottery and different art. And while it may be a bit early to start thinking of keeping warm for the winter, City Family and Community Services is holding a health fair at Los Griegos Health and Social Services Center at 1231 Candelaria Road in the North Valley. The fair will include a school supply and backpack giveaway, along with a blanket drive to collect new blankets to help keep Albuquerque citizens warm this winter. There will also be a mobile clothing bank on site for anyone needing assistance with extra clothing. And that wraps up this week's edition. We hope you join us again next week for the latest city news right here on One Albuquerque Media. I'm Augusta Myers. Thanks for joining me.